at him. He's being needy. Typical. He's needy. I want to go in, and then everyone like turn their head like, that's a cow. He's half Indo Brazilian, half gear. They're a lot different than any other cow. When you touch them, just anywhere, you get this oil. They're really good in the heat because they repel insects like you wouldn't believe. 20 hours one way just to pick them up in Texas. He lifts his leg when you scratch him right here. <laughs> I took Eeyore to Dr. Pole because my animals mean a lot to me and I do not want just anybody handling them. I knew Dr. Pole wouldn't judge him just because he's a Brahma bull. Dr. Pohl, he was just so excited. So that's all the horns they have? Well, they don't fully mature until they're five years old. I can remember that procedure like it was yesterday. Dr. Pohl brought out like a screwdriver. Come on, big boy. His nose bit was successful. My face was like, ooh, I can't watch that. Eeyore is so healthy. He's been happy. He's getting big. This is the only kind of animal that you can hug your butt. Dr. Pohl was so supportive of me riding Eeyore. He knew, he had faith in me that I could get on him and ride him successfully. This is about as far as we've gotten with him. We've actually got him to take a few steps, but of course it's new to him. He's just a big baby. Oh, riding Eeyore! Oh my God, this day has come, the day has came. <laughs> Oh, he's going fast. <laughs> this is the first time I'm actually riding him. This is the longest. He doesn't even care. Eeyore, I love you so much. <laughs> he gets all the ladies. Oh, there we go. <laughs> My experience with Dr. Paul was just, I talk about it all the time because when you really have a good passion for animals and you have someone that connects with you and sees what you see, it's just a, really hard to explain. All standards were met. My cow was taken care of, he's happy, healthy, and he got his nose bit. I couldn't ask for more than that. <laughs>